nothing to do with leaves they are just come movement you know movement to your either your four chord if you're going to your four chord or you're going to your five chord whichever one you're going okay they are just you can you can picture them as leaves or reeds they are just movement to those any of these chord changes you're going you want to approach okay so this is it now the key of the song is E flat okay I'm using five string bass I get these messages or this comment a lot I should teach using four string bass mind you mind you it's not all about the strings it's not all about whether you're using five string you're using six string you're using four strings if I can give you a two string bass what will you do with it 
okay so you need to just take away that mindset of you take away that mindset of you whenever you see something whenever they are showing you something take that thing and run along try sort it out try figure it out if you use it for string try sort it out and that's why I say this every time practice 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 so it's not all about the five string it's not all about the six string or four string you can do anything you want to do the fact this is called the bass guitar okay so that's it now the key of the song is E flat this is my E flat and this is my E flat okay so and the progression of that song is one four just the progression of the song now let's see how we can use those gospel movements to beautify this progression now the first movement I did on that song is which is known as my six five four three going to my four four then my five five okay so that's it last of me so that's the first movement i did there then the second movement is That one is you linking to your six notes, okay? From your four, flat five, drop to seven, then six, two, five. Okay? Now, Master Jesus, okay, that part of the song. Master Jesus, drop into four, flat five, seven, three, then six. You go to your two, two, then five, then one. Okay, so that's the second movement I did there. Fiti mi la re so do. Fiti mi la re so do. Now the third one is. Third one there started from the five notes of my E flat majors scale. Okay, so four, five. Okay, now five, one, four, three. your progression okay turn it up annotation is so do fa mi so do fa mi do so fa mi so do fa mi do so fa mi okay fa so Something like 
that. So that's the top movement, okay? There's another one you can do something like you know, things like that. So there's another one I did and that song I did. Master Jesus, there's another movement there. I intentionally hit on the flat five. It can be played this way. That part there, Master Jesus, that part there is as if you're speaking with the singer, okay? Jesus, okay, but I intentionally drop on five, flat five, okay? It's supposed to be Master Jesus, you are the Buddha, you're going to your fall. So what I did there was one seven six five flat five four okay then i continue this the progression movements i'm going to put them together so you hear how it sound and also easily learn how to apply them when playing any gospel song you come across at all okay so this is it gospel movement you can use to spice up your playing there are thousand and one gospel movement that is available for you you know the more you grow the more the more you're into it the more you get to find them and you know them okay so that is it guys basically these are just the move there I did on that song this hope this is helpful and hope you enjoy yourself it's just easy to achieve okay keep practicing and um, also if you're new to this channel i won't stop saying it until you hit that subscribe button if you're new to this channel please do not leave without hitting that subscribe button looking at you right there that red button looking at you just hit on it and turn on the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever i drop new videos okay i upload videos regularly and 
if I'm not mistaken, maybe once in a week or twice in a week, okay? I drop videos. So please like, comment, share, okay? Please like, comment, share and get more people to subscribe. And also, if you need private lessons from me, um, it's not free. <laughs> okay, every information you need to reach out to me is in the description below. Chat me by WhatsApp and send me email. Okay, um, that's all. I love you guys. Peace out. One love.